Hey guys, David again here at Express Auto Transmission. We've got a 6L80 on the bench today. This one came in on a 2012 Silverado. Uh, truck had extreme torque converter shutter. We've uh, got the transmission out of it and we're going to tear it down and see if we can't show you what a glitter bomb looks like on the inside. We're going to start pulling our pump over and get the pan off and see what we got. Look at the metal. That's not the worst one we've ever seen, but she's definitely, definitely sparkly. Start by getting her filter out. Is that filter clogged? Yeah, buddy. Look, yep. look at this. The metal in it. Yep, she is super shiny there. We like the glitter. Glitter's a good thing here. Get the valve body off. Come on, turkey. Oh, yeah. We're going to set our valve body to the side. Open her up, see what we can't find down in, inside of her. So those come out as one unit on one, these? Yep, one all unit. Later on, we'll get that tore down, show you some subsections. We'll get an input drum. One, two, three, four clutch, and three, five reverse, and input clutch. Get that set off to the side. We'll start pulling the guts out of her. All this stuff will get put in the washer and get all the metal out of it and get all the solvent out of it get the contamination out of the bearings and fix some of the some of the biggest weakest links in these units giant pair of frisky pliers this snap ring is not friendly anybody that's played with one knows about them but you don't want to get your fingers caught in that guy she's a beast and they make two foot long pliers just for that i'm gonna pull out our Center support and clutch housing here. Try to let some of the some of the leaks fall out there. We're gonna get our planetary system out. We'll get it cleaned up, and inspected, and find out what we got in there. Pull our rear carrier out. My God, boys, we're at the bottom. That was quick. That sure didn't take long, did it? Let's see, uh, let's see what some of these clutches look like. See if we can, can decide how bad she is. But we're not, we're not saving any of this stuff, are you? Nope. On our rebuilds, on a 6L80, 6L90 family, all this gets replaced. All new clutches, new steels, new seals, new pistons. We like to update everything with the latest, greatest products that are available to us in the transmission industry. This drum is a real high failure rate. I mean, just... Just a real bad problem in these units. So anytime we build one, we'll put a new new AC Delco drum in them, keep them from cracking again. What drum is that? That's your one, two, three, four, three, five reverse drum. We're gonna move down to the to the bottom here. Clutch-wise, this thing really didn't look as, as terrible as what we expected. But it does have its issues. And that, that metal in that fan didn't come from, from nowhere. It didn't just generate it today. Sometimes we see them with, with a lot of a lot of clutch damage, sometimes we see them with just a little clutch damage. More often than not, it's the latter. 
those ones you can see where they're starting to get hot, starting to blacken some of the clutches. So let's get that pump apart real quick and see if we can't uh, see if we can't see a problem. Stator tore down the rest of the way once we get her get her bench cleaned up a little bit, get some of these parts out of the way. What typically happens on these units is the converter, whenever it comes apart, it puts metal everywhere. We'll set this to the side here. As always, stator support. Got some big old groovies in her. Oh, wow. Yeah, buddy. Every time. Converter comes apart, and man, she just puts the groovies in everything. We'll put a new bell housing on it and updated stator support and new pump rotor and gears. And you can see the you can see the marring and the chewing in the inside of that one. That's a deep groove. You can't see it on the video real well, but you can definitely feel it. Oh yeah. Yep, that metal just goes through everything and wipes her out. As always, guys, we greatly appreciate you taking the time to check out our videos. Like, subscribe, share, tell your friends about them. Uh, if you guys want to see more stuff like this, just let us know, comment, and tell us, and we'll, we'll get into any transmission that you guys want to see. We've got, got just about anything sitting in the shop from, a, from an Allison 1000 series to... 4L60 to Subaru to T56. We've got just about everything in here. We gotta we gotta touch one of them eventually. So just let us know. Thank you guys as always.